headquarters, the Lucci gang. Yeah, at the hotel, and they came from Fairfield, California. So shout out, shout out to y'all. Thank y'all for always supporting us. Before we get our day going, make sure you stay true. Do you know it? <laughs> Do you know it? I'm like, starstruck. <laughs> make sure you stay true, hit the like button. Don't be a hater, like, subscribe right now. We pulled up to Grace's table to eat breakfast. Show them, baby. I got a parking ticket. <laughs> we didn't know no better, though. And then the police, the cop, whatever, the lady, the patrol, she was low key being extra. She could have gave us a warning. Yeah, I was like, hey, I didn't know I couldn't park right there. She was like, no, you can't move your car, but you're still getting a ticket. But we're gonna eat breakfast, it's all good. We might go pay this after we eat. I ain't gonna pay that. I'm gonna pay it. It's a rental car. Today we're going to San Francisco. Lucky got a tamale. And I got me some pork and egg tacos. Look at that. How delicious and beautiful does that look? Mm. Good? So we said bye bye to Napa Valley. Juice out the roof. I got a ticket. Started raining. They canceled my hot air balloon ride. So I wasn't feeling Napa Valley this morning. It's ready to get out of there. But now we're pulling up to San Francisco. The Bay. The Golden Gate Bridge. I'm so excited. I've never seen it in real life. I've only seen it on TV and pictures. And look at how beautiful this is. We've been saying that it's so beautiful out here since we got here. But just look at it. Bam. I'll take you there, baby. We are here. Golden Gate Bridge. Steph Curry with it. Chinatown in San Francisco. Lucky says he wants some dry plums. Y'all, the struggle was real trying to find parking, but we were finally found some. Okay, remember the street, Washington and what? What is this street right here? We're trying not to get lost, y'all. It legit looks like we're outside of Washington and what? I'm pretty sure this is Sacramento. It feels like we're in China. You wanna go that way? Let me show y'all. Hey, right, baby? Yeah. It's so weird. Never been somewhere like this. Oh, shit. I used to love those. You don't wanna try in here? Yeah. Are those it? That's what they look like, but I don't know. This is them. I don't know which, what are the difference, but that's them. Just get three. Try them. They're only two dollars. This one looks good. Not really. These look good. We're trying to find salted what? Plums. Salted plums. These are them, but I don't know which is which because they got they got Chinese letters. Yeah. It's right in here. You think they have some here? Hi, do you have salt salted plums? Salt 
So I got what I was looking for. Tell them how long it's been. It's been years, 20, 20, 25 years. This little Chinese store that I used to go to when I was little, they used to sell these. And uh, the store closed down and I could never find these nowhere in Houston. So when I came here, I was on a mission to find them in Chinatown and I found them. Salt plum. Let's try it. We're gonna walk down here. I think the next street down has like a big Chinatown sign. It's, I'm not... a, it's a dried plum with salt all over it. Mm. <laughs> These are the sweet ones. So this one has sugar and salt, so it's all right. Let me see. But well, the other good? ones were straight salt, no sugar. Is it good? Yeah, it was good. Here. I don't know how I feel about this, but one time for Chinatown, one time for our honeymoon. You gotta just throw it in your mouth. There's a seed in there. Yeah, because it's a plum. You don't need the seed though, right? Uh-uh. Oh, this is good. Uh-uh. <laughs> what happened? Okay, baby, I don't know how you're doing that. <coughs> <coughs> what happened? It don't mix good. The salt and the sugar or what? Yeah. All right, we'll be back. I didn't like it. So I got me the big pack of these. These are so good. Oh, I'll just open it. We're trying to walk down so we can show y'all and, you know, buy a couple things and explore. We had to get out of there. We had to get out of there. We had to get out of there quick. Yo, Chinatown. It's got a strong aroma. <laughs> They're selling dried fish outside and ew, it smells like dried shrimp, dried milk. all that. Ugh. Oh my god. But we're heading out. I think we're gonna go look, look, look at this mirror over here. Look, right there. Y'all see Buddha? Y'all see him? It's dope. Like the art, the culture is really, really, really awesome to see. But at the same time, it was like too crowded, overpopulated, too much going on. And they was giving me Corona vibes. <laughs> I was remembering how hard it was to breathe when I had that COVID. I was like, man. I'm oh, no, you didn't say Corona vibes. Oh, God. We're going to head to the Fisherman's Wharf. That's how you say it? Uh, yeah, Fisherman's Wharf. And we're going to go try and grab some food and just check it out. We are literally by the and actually like walk through it. And get some seafood. <laughs> amen, amen, amen. Shrimp and crab. We're about two minutes away from the fisherman's wharf. Do you have the rookie? Yeah. We got to our hotel. We're on the 18th floor, look. It's three more floors, let me show you. Lucky's ready to call it a day, and I'm like, bruh, barely one. I'm gonna take a nap. It's barely one o'clock. When you get my age, you gotta take a nap in the afternoon. It's four o'clock Texas time right now. It's three o'clock Texas time. But we are gonna go grab a bike because I wanna go walk around. I think we're gonna have to drive though, because Lucky Didn't just. Did just see us walk around? We walked around, right? We just walked like two little blocks. <laughs> That was Chinatown. Where else you want to walk around to? Here. Uh, he is over me. He's over me. I'm over this honey road. <laughs> <laughs> oh my bro. Because she knows right now I don't have the energy of I would be laying down and sleep, but it's because it's our honeymoon and I'm letting her do what she want to do. So I'm out here and I'm going with her for a while to go get some food, even though. I um, just would rather lay down by the street <laughs> and go get some dinner at 7 o'clock. Maestro's right down the street. I was already planning. We gonna do that too. 
We're gonna do that too. I'm not. I'm not gonna let my honeymoon go to waste. I'm going to go walk around and run the bike. Let's go. So we're on our way to go grab. Is this it? We made it. Sitting outside under the fire. There's a heater right here to keep us warm because it's kind of cool out here. And we're just gonna eat a light lunch. I ordered like this crab pasta that looked really good on Yelp. So I'm excited to try it. And then, um, yeah. I got uh, prawns and scallops. Y'all, we honestly don't know what we're doing up here in San Francisco. <laughs> we're just trying to go with the flow. If they were up to lucky, we'd be in the room sleep. Watch some TV. Yeah. But not I, said Kelly Jean. So we just found out we're in North Beach. Little Italy. It's called Little, they call it Little Italy over here. And um, if we haven't told y'all, we're at Soto Mare. So. Fresh seafood restaurant. Oh my God. Enjoy. Thank you. That looks so good. I love scallops. Mm. Yeah, I'm about to dig in. Well, that was good. Now we're coming back to the room because I need to take me a nap. I need a siesta. I tell you, she, she got to give me about three hours. It's three o'clock now. And, uh, yeah. I'll be ready about six. I'll be re recharged. But I think we're gonna end the vlog here, just so it could give me some time to edit. Uh, you're gonna edit it right now? Try to, yeah. Shout out to Kelly Jean for editing these vlogs for y'all, man. <laughs> Cause yeah, y'all wouldn't have got no content from me. Well, we really appreciate y'all for watching. Make sure you like, subscribe, turn on your notifications, and comment down below.